Test one, test two. I hope I can find the microphone this time and it's working. Because I really think that this is a very serious video that needs done. Um, ISIS forces Syrian Christians to sign a contract under the threat of death. They're taking the mark, people. Get real. It's what it is. They're taking the mark. I have said and I have said that ISIS will usher in. They're the harbinger of the beast. They're the harbinger of the main wad that's a coming. They're ushering it in and they're getting people ready for it. This is a contract that they're signing. You know, if you notice on down in here, they're not allowed to own any guns or anything. Uh, they must not perform religious rituals in public, which, of course, means you can't witness the gospel. <clears throat> it says here that they may not show the cross or any of their books to the Muslims in the streets or in the markets. Uh, they may not use amplifiers when worshiping during prayer. In other words, you can't let anybody hear the name Jesus Christ if they're around. And if you do, you're, you're going to get killed. It tells you right here that as soon as you do, you're treated as a combatant. Folks, wake up. This is the people that we're not that, that that they're not letting us fight too hard. This is the people that's right among you here in the United States of America at the local mosque. At your local mosque, there may not be all. I'm not saying there is, but they're right there among you, folks. Wake up, wake up, America. Wake up because if they can do it to them over there and get them used to it, there they are. There's the Christians signing the paperwork saying, "Yes, I will do your bidding." And right here, it talks about it, right here in Revelations. No, you're going to have people say, uh, Pastor Kelly, there's no mark. Well, they're putting their mark on the paper, aren't they? They're putting their mark on the paper, and they can't buy or sell or, or, or commune or do anything with the public if they haven't signed that paper. And if they don't sign that paper, they're killed. Now, what would you call it? What exactly would you call it? It's like they took a playbook right out of Revelations, hey? Well, folks, wake up. That's all I can tell you. The reason I say we had to wake up so hard is I had to go all the way to Israel on the Internet to even get this article. And this may show up on the bottom page of Fox or CNN tomorrow. Praise God. But I, I had to get it out tonight. I had to get it out tonight. I'm rushing this video. I'm rushing my words. But I'm trying to keep it short so everybody will hear the rest of it. And I know you. everybody likes those three to four minute videos. Praise God. Hallelujah and amen. The Lord is with us. The Lord is with me. The Lord is with you if you just asked him. Because if you're not saved, you better get that away. Because they're working their way toward here. And then when you're at your local town hall and they got that piece of paper saying, Sign it or you don't eat and you don't have your head to eat with. Think about what Pastor Kelly was a preaching to you. Think about it. Praise God. Think about it hard, folks. Pray on it. Discern it. Think about it. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up, America. Wake up. Uh, the ones that already have, get this word out for us, man. Keep posting and keep reposting and get the word out. God bless you one and all. Pastor Kelly's out of here.